Raise Express allows you to have an external file linked with phrases that you want to use. And then as you add more phrases to your external file, they get recognized um, any, every time you restart Phrase Express. So for this example, the, the file needs to be an Excel file. For this example, I have a, a very simple file here that says uh, it's just called email, email phrases. And you can see here a few examples. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add that here so you can see how it gets um, linked to the program. I'm going to start by closing the file. And I have the, the file here on a separate screen, but here it is. And so I'm going to, I'm dragging it and I'm going to drop it here under phrases. And I get this little um, window asking me how to include the external file. So there are different ways in which I can do that, but uh, I'm going to use the last option, which is link the file and generate phrases from each line into a dynamic folder. So I'm going to say, okay, and you can see that it has been added here. And here are the phrases that are going to be added. You saw that these are the phrases that were in the Excel file earlier. And we're going to try them and see if they're working, right? So I'm going to try CTY, IMV, and BRG to see if they work. I just, um, this is just for us to make sure that this is being identified correctly and actually it's being packed, picked up in the wrong way. So I, this is going to be the abbreviation or the, remember here, abbreviations are called auto texts. And this is the expansion. So um, this is actually the, the text or the description, um, so to speak. So I actually, I don't want this one, but I can just simply not use it. So I'm going to say, okay. And now it has been added and you can see that it's being, um, it's um, being enabled. And so now I'm going to go here and say CTY and that is deploying or IMV, right? And so that's how you can easily keep um, all of your phrases in an Excel file if you'd like to do that. And then simply, you know, you can either um, keep them all in a single file or classify them by, um, by name, like for example, email phrases or phrases for something else on a separate file. So I think that's really cool.